There are enough smart people in the world, but not so many good people. So, why is being a Christian so, so bad? What is so bad about being truthful? What is so bad about remaining faithful to someone? What is so bad about having good morals? Thou shalt not steal. You know very well that this food, this bicycle, this thing you so much desire to take does not belong to you. So what is so wrong about asking before taking? Thou shalt not commit adultery. You are a married man. You are a married woman. What is so wrong about remaining faithful to your husband or wife? What is so bad about Christianity? Thou shalt not kill. Guys, you don't give life. Why should you hold the power to take it? What is so wrong about not killing your brother? Why is being a Christian so, so bad? I mean, even if you strip the Christian religion down to its very core skeleton, take away the hypocrisy and a few bad knots, we are still left with the Ten Commandments. So what is so wrong about being a Christian? And if we strip it further down to its ultimate belief, its ultimate skeleton, we are still left with none other than love your neighbor as yourself. So I am asking you, what is so wrong about being a Christian. Being a Christian is not a bad thing. It only means we are undergoing profound changes, profound transformation, which is being orchestrated by the Holy Spirit of God. We are becoming a new leaf, a new being. And I'm asking again, what is so wrong about it? It is not too late to believe, and it is not too late to be saved. God can wipe the slate clean. Not because we deserve it. For by grace we are saved through faith. You cannot buy your way into heaven. And surely you cannot work your way through the gate of heaven. Remember, God is unchanging. And most importantly, his judgment is unchanging. My name is Dr. Dredd and this has been Today's World, where every episode brings you closer to understanding the world around us. Thank you for watching and don't forget to like, subscribe and share so that others might benefit from this message. Until next time, may you continue to walk in the faith, hope and peace of God.